You see these two people? They are from the same country. Almost the same situation. But just that the only difference is one is not living in the situation and the others are living in the situation. Hmm? Yesterday was Nigeria Independence Day at 64. At 64. Back home in Nigeria, massive protest in Abuja. Massive protest. In fact, it involved police to start throwing chair gases. But in New York City, Nigeria's over there, we are celebrating Nigeria Independence Day. In you know what? Yesterday, when I went out, I saw a friend. I said, Happy Independence Day. The guy almost insulted my family. He said, I beg, Adam Slink. Tell me Happy New Month. I will be happy. Don't tell me Happy Independence Day. I remember when I was a kid. Eh? If Nigeria was celebrating Independence Day, you start seeing green, white, green everywhere. But you hardly see green, white, green anywhere nowadays. Everybody's angry. Angry. But in New York City, you see Nigerians over there celebrating. Happy. Had a carnival. Huge one. How can you celebrate your independence so happy in another person's country? Enjoying free education. Enjoying light security, and getting paid for your labor well without being delayed. And you can pay your bills if you work. Meanwhile, back home, you see Nigerians are not happy, protesting. How do you celebrate it, my people in New York City? How? How do you block the screen of your Nigeria? You, you, you block the screen and you just look the other way and celebrate it. I'm not saying that there's anything wrong with celebrating Nigeria Independence Day, but I think at least hmm, we owe Nigeria every, so, every form of uh, solidarity. Hmm? We owe Nigeria and Nigerians. At least check out your brothers and sisters at home before going out to a party. In New York City, they were celebrating. In Abuja, they were, they were protesting. New York City, in another man's house, you are celebrating your home. But in your home, there is fire. Make it make sense, guys. You are in another man's house, celebrating building your house. But your house is burning down. How does it really make sense? How? How? Make it make sense. Because that is literally what was happening yesterday. How can you sit comfortably in another man's house? Celebrating. Building a house. Meanwhile, you are celebrating your house is on fire. And you know, you know, you don't, you don't tell me you don't read the news. See, Nigerians, uh, independence, hmm? Nigeria is not that bad for everybody. Let me, me, me make it clear to you. But you and I, common Nigerians, know who Nigeria is not bad to. I don't need to tell you who Nigerians has been good to. You know them. You know their kids. Nigeria has been really, really good to them. But it's just that out of the 100% of Nigerians, eh, only 5% or even lesser has enjoyed this kind of benefit from Nigeria. It hasn't spread around. It hasn't. According to this uh, Nigeria actor, Chidi, he said, I congratulate every Nigerian who, in spite of the cluelessness of government, continue independently provide their own security, healthcare, electricity, light, education, welfare, food, even if not zero 
1-0. Now you be your own government. Then he also said, For light, I provide my own transformer. I provide my own electricity pole. I provide my own electricity cable. I provide my own ele electricity meter. And even though this item I provided don't belong to me, they belong to the government, but I still have to cover maintenance costs. On top of that, I still have to provide my own generator and buy fuel, diesel, at most ridiculous price to run my generator to provide my own electricity. For water, I provide my own boil oil. I provide my own water pipe. I provide my own water storage tank. I provide my own pumping machine and still have to buy diesel and at ridiculous price to be able to pump and provide my own water. For security, I provide my own house gate. I provide my own street gate. I provide my own estate gate. I provide my own guard man to, to man all those gates. But still, on top of all this, now God and we did. Make stray bullets no meat person for outside. For healthcare, fake doctors, fake drugs, fake everything, and we still they pay. But prayers still they work because now only God, now why we never buy. For education, call, infrastructure, call, development, call, good government, call, government magic. Whether them like or they no like, now me be my own government. I am independent. Exactly. I am independent. Every Nigeria is independent. Whatever he said, check him. Don't reason the whole matter. Reason now. I love the speech, guys. I love that independent uh, uh, message. Electricity. Are you not providing your own meter? Nobody using the buy cable. Nobody using the buy pole. If you know buy pole, you meet pole there. The person may buy pole. You go give her money. Or if you get your own house, know it now. If you build your own house, you see, say your neighbor already get pole. You want tap from that pole. You will pay him a certain money because now he provide that pole. No be government provide that pole. Transform uncle. They deter a community. Ah, make we uh, contribute money to buy another transformer. If you wait for government, you will do like this. Meter uncle, of course, you don't say meter, don't they buy meter now. And yet, light no good day. They will make them so high. You will see, buy your generator, see the fuel. What uncle, nobody you will provide your own boil. If you don't get boil, you will buy water tire for Mirua. So tell me, tell me, say Adam Sling, you are ungrateful. You should be happy celebrating independence. Tell me one thing. One, just one thing you think I should celebrate independence for. Tell me one. Say, Adam Slink, this is what you should be celebrating independence for. One thing. Or tell other Nigerians. One thing you think they should be celebrating independence for. For security, Uko. Gates, if you go any place, you see fence, total fence everywhere. And it's not supposed to be so. Supposed to build your house, clear your grass, your neighbor can be seeing your house, nothing consign you. Free, no insecurity. But you go you go spend money, man. You go take carry house, go up, take a do gates, hundred by hundred gates. You know how much for cement and block for hundred by hundred gates? You know how big, how huge. That is, then you go buy barbed wire. For those of them make a guess more money, they will do electric, uh, electric uh, gates and uh, wire around the fence. That's another cost. You know, hand for deal. You know, still hand for deal. Go buy dog. Go buy dog. You know, still hand for deal. You go buy dog now, two or three dog, and to feed a dog in a month. You go spend at that kind of 1600k in a month, vaccine and everything. You go back, you go to the bath dog to, to, to man your gates. For those of you that don't know if you buy court, they go even buy one thing, one thing to talk. Or buy a lamb 
alarm everywhere. Security for this side, you, you go put, see, you go put a, a protector, huge, huge protector, tick, tick one. Ah, danja. Money, things make we not supposed to spend money on. How would they spend money on? For security. You go put yourself for inside prison for your house. House me suppose they free, waka. You lock yourself into inside prison. CTV everywhere. That is not enough. You should not get small cup on our come together, go do gate. Now do gate. The gate will not man himself. You now go do another guard. That's if you, even though you get security man for house, you go see, pay money, build a table, pull one guard. Me go demand that, uh, that uh, a small estate. Then community, you go see, pay yo, community yo, for security, yo, for vigilantes. Again. Ha! You want to talk about child birth? You want to talk about raising a child? You want to talk about raising a child? You want to talk about transportation? You want to talk about so many other stuff? What is the opportunity? Tell me! Tell me! Person in New York, the another person house, they celebrate independence. Happy independence to Nigeria, guys. Happy, happy independence to Nigeria. Then, if person they fight for Nigeria, they will say the reason why people like you don't fight before and they don't buy. Go check fella. That's why portable insult fella. He said, Fela no the open man, they talk anyhow. Fela for live long. Ha! Me, why very dark man day here now. And they say, make with go see that very dark man go meet the end. The end. We know say go meet the end. Like, I don't understand. We don't really, oh, they do also. They do us for this country. They, oh, oh, oh. Our self-esteem, our courage has been broken mentally, physically. Indirectly, we break our children's courage by saying, oh, oh, they do also. See what a person now. This gay activist may don't run, go USA. He run from a country, go USA, see what they talk. He said, very soon, it's the same Nigeria, the very dark man will be the biggest victim on. The table he, he is trying to shake, he thinks he is making a point. But what he has failed to realize is the battle he is fighting is one he can never win. In the long run, and he will soon be committed to the graveyard of history. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Can you imagine, guys? Eh? Can you imagine? Our common talk in this country is, ah! Now only you, you want to buy. It's, you see, the fear is in every one of us. One way or the other. Even the bravest in, in, in this country, they know this, they, they know this stone not to step. Even the bravest one, even the very dark man himself. He knows stone making no go step. Oh. He knows in his heart, he knows. Ah. This one of the stone me are not supposed to step. Oh. If I step this stone, I will I, go, I don't go. He knows because of our that one is so common in this country. But then again, happy Independence Day to Nigeria. I wish you all the best. Now Nigerians say now that they typically call that Nigeria be the real MVP of being independent. I swore God. Every Nigeria should be celebrating independence. Eh? Even the one may go New York City and all those places. Those genuine may they strive, they don't see they suffer. No government affiliation. Hmm? They are the real MVP of being an independent person in a country. Ah, you can't take that away from them. You can. We are the real independent people. We provide absolutely everything for ourselves. So I pay independent to me as a Nigerian. 
as a Nigerian. And I, was, I celebrate independence every day. Every day I celebrate it. Every day. There's no special day for independence. Independence uh, for me. Bye.